Radio ¿cómo están? Hello. Okay, guys, we are back with Station 19. This is coming a little bit late because I'm living in a new apartment back in the capital because we are back with classes. So I'm going to university again and it's been kind of chaotic. I have new roommates, so I'm kind of working the schedules to see when can I react to Station 19 and Grey's Anatomy. Hopefully I can keep doing it on Fridays, but today I had to do it on Friday afternoon, so I had to wait a bit, so it's probably gonna be up. Maybe today is Saturday when this is up. So yeah, whatever. This is like a lot of technical things and stuff that made me upload this a bit late, but well, whatever. I'm gonna start watching this video because I'm very excited to see what's gonna go down here. Uh, we're gonna have marina scenes, which I'm obviously most excited about those, and I can wait to see it, but I'm also very excited about Big and her dealing with the abortion because I love that they're touching this subject. So I can wait to see it and I don't want to talk too much and just get down with it. So let's do it, let's go. And I'm also going to let you know that I'm going to be drinking mate, but this is not my thermos because apparently mine just broke. So I, I hope I don't burn my hands, hopefully. Okay, let's go. What our turnouts should look like. So and then, thank you for <laughs> him <laughs> being <laughs> there. He's like moving away from um, him. I'm gonna make some popcorn. Are you oh, we've talked about this already, but are you sure you want me to come here tomorrow for the pill and just kind of all of it? Probably okay, you told him. I think this is probably something that Theo and I need to do. Yeah, Theo okay. accused me of... Do you think I have not noticed that you can't... You can't stand to be alone with him? I haven't talked You're to him being about annoying. it. Annoying. Well, that's true, so do you want to talk about it now? No, thank you. Here. <laughs> He's like, he doesn't want to talk about it. And Emmett is very oh, angry. Mar, you need me, I love you. I mean, come on, dude. Talk to Emmett. Like, he deserves to be to talk to. You know, to be talked to. I am glad that we finally did this, though. Well, like, no, technically, we've Are done they? this before. Are they That's even a date? actually doing this. No, I, I, I thought good. about you for years, okay? Oh, damn. Do no. you think the only reason why things were easy when we were together is because we were in an actual war? They were a couple I then. Think. Oh, damn. We just get together. Hmm. Oh, damn it. Okay. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I like them, though, okay. but I don't know. Oh, wow. Fancy. Wow. He's drinking a lot. Oh, yeah, otherwise I just have to come here every day. I'm going to go home, drown He's my an show. alcoholic now. To your phone call. Night, night. Damn. This is no good. That wasn't good. Yeah, that wasn't good. It wasn't good that he saw them, and it's not good that he's still drinking. These are two he's problems. He's a Danish expat, so generations of great healthcare. Babies! And he's an award-winning archer. Oh, damn. Uh, they are looking for friends on her. Mine are clearly a genius. The guy is Mensa. And look, his baby picture looks like Andrea. Okay. You get to carry, and it's gonna be your egg. Shouldn't I okay. get to win this one? Oh, honey, Wait, it's not about do winning. winning. Do you want to be the one that carries? No, but I get it. Something about her. That. I'm just saying. That looks like her, I guess. I don't know what I'm saying. You know, I just like my pick better. Besides, okay. there's no guarantee that it'll be a genius if we go with yours. Exactly. <laughs> so what does it actually matter which of the two we pick? Well, it doesn't well. matter. <laughs> Why don't we just go with mine? Uh, okay, wait. Are we back to... Wait, 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 wait. I just want to say, I want them to pick someone that maybe look like Maya. Not that they are like a genius or a archer. I mean, of course that would be cool. But find someone that looks like Maya, because if Karina's going to carry it, at least, you know, if the, when the baby is born, maybe Maya's gonna be feel a bit closer to the baby. I don't know, I don't know, but I think maybe they should choose someone that kind of looks like Maya. I know that doesn't mean anything because it doesn't have to look like them to be their kid. Of course not. That's stupid. But, you know, I think that Maya kind of wants that. You know, she wants to be a part of it somehow, right? Because Karina is going to carry the baby. And if also Karina picks the donor, it's going to be like, it's all Karina, right? So I think Maya also feels like she she wants to be a part of it. She needs to do something to be involved, right? So I get that feeling of wanting to be a part of it somehow. So, yeah, I really, I don't know. I hope they can pick one together. But I hope that Karina understands why Maya wants to pick one right okay are we back to step one no no oh, okay. no <laughs> she's like okay we're not we're not. not but i am late for shift and so are you okay but we will talk about this later i love you i love you oh thanks for the coffee 
their but, kisses uh, and Maya being like, I mean, guys, let me see that kiss again because I miss their kisses. Oh, babies. And she's like, to the coffee. <laughs> Pleasure. Pleasure. Oh, I miss their kisses so much. That was so cute. Such a kiss. I love it. They're what? so damn cute. Let you know I had my fun. So don't let this little slip up the far in the rest of your career. The end of it. He's talking about Appreciate himself, it, I think. Hughes appreciates you subbing for her. Kath, Sean. Oh, she's subbing for Vic. But isn't she captain of 23 now? What are you doing? How is she subbing? <laughs> well, that's a nice... No, no, I mean, what are you doing in there? <laughs> I told you that. She's not <laughs> doing <laughs> him. <laughs> Hi, sorry. Oh, oh, honey, I love that she's there so, uh, for them. Have... <sighs> okay. This must have been... This must be awful. Are you ready? Yeah. They have to put that inside of you? Oh, freaking. I hate when they just. You go to their China colleges and they just put it inside of you. That sucks. It hurts. She's singing. Honey. I want to check your blood pressure before you go home. Okay. okay. I love how she also. Because she worries about her. Because she's also, her page me if you feel sick at all. Yeah. If you vomit, you risk to lose the medication before it takes effect. But I wouldn't want that. Okay. I'll be back in a bit. God, it's so important to talk about abortion, guys. It's important. I love that you're doing this. So what wine do you think pairs best with an abortion? I'm thinking, like, earthy red. Right. <laughs> she has to, you know. Hey, it's just her. us. You don't have to do your jokey thing. Okay, well, my jokey thing is who I am, so if you want... You no. go. No, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, he's gonna stay. But this is not easy, you know. You go have to go through that. It sucks to have to make that decision. And people think like I want to talk about this because obviously this subject is something that I've I've thought about and I always argue with people online about is that and even more before when abortion. Uh, was a subject mostly in Argentina because in Argentina, which is my neighbor country, right? Abortion was approved uh, last year, was it or 2020? Uh, so that talk about abortion was was there, you know, all the time. And I remember talking about it with them and uh, with people um, at that time. And and it's hard. It's not like oh yeah, sure, I'm I okay if I get pregnant, I can get abortions, whatever. It's so easy. It's not easy to go, to have to go through an abortion. It's not an easy thing. It's not an easy thing. How could it be an easy thing, you know? But the fact is we have a choice, right? And that's what we need to fight about because, you know, um, something that we always talk about is that abortions happen. They happen whether they are legal or they are illegal. They happen. And that's the thing why legal abortion is something that is talked about. And we still have a long way to go in the world for abortion to be legal everywhere because abortions happen. They happen, they have happened since the beginning of times and they still happen. And it doesn't matter if they are legal or illegal, they happen. That's the problem. The, the fact that we have legal abortion is that we have a choice to go to a safe place to have an abortion if that's what we decide to do. And that way we won't die. Because that's what happens with illegal abortions. They don't give a shit if you die. Unless you have a lot of money and you go to someone that actually knows what they're doing, but you need money for that. This way, by legal abortion, you don't need to have a lot of money. You can be a regular person. It happened for some reason, your protection didn't work or you forgot or whatever and you got pregnant. And now you have a choice. And you don't, ha you don't need thousands of dollars to pay for an abortion. You know, and that's why it's so important because abortions happen, they happen and we need legal ways to make it safer. That's it. And I love that they are talking about it. Obviously here, abortion is legal, thankfully, and they are, they are mostly showing not, uh, not, they are not talking about abortion is a good thing or a bad thing. It's about what you go through when you have one. And I love that they are doing this. I don't know if they are going to talk about something else about abortion, but I love that they are doing it and they are showing how it is to like go through one. Um, I think this is so important. So I can wait to keep watching this and see how Beck is going to deal with this. Yeah.
And that's it. That's all I wanted to say. <laughs> How are you feeling? Terrific. Yeah, I great. love Karina Vina yeah. for her. As long as everything as her looks doctor. good, I'm going to give you the second sequence of pills. It will cause your uterus to contract and shed its lining and any content. It okay. will last a day or two and it's similar to a heavy period. Okay. It's good yeah, that they questions? explain this to uh, you. No, no. no. Uh, what I'm to good. do, please? Because what do you do after that? Okay, Just everything please. looks good. You can call me. Okay, you have my number. Yeah, Trump's. Trump's. I'll make sure she does, yeah. Okay. Okay. Thanks, Doc. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. I love it. I love them. Plus, you should probably just go home. No, I, I'm gonna... He's gonna stay with her. I'm gonna sit around with you while I've been doing some reading and... Oh, okay. So you and your penis are gonna tell me and my OB how a medical abortion works. That's... Uh, he's trying to help. I get that. Um, yeah. I'm sorry. He's trying to be I'm there sorry, for us. For the tenth time, I want to. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, please get back together and be nice, please. <laughs> I really love Vic and Theo. I'm shipping them. I love them. So I need them to get back together. I love Vic and Theo. Please. Yeah, you're yelling at work and at your lieutenant. Yeah. Well, I'm not trying to something's still up. But everyone in this building is a mess. But I'm the only one in trouble. I'm just... Well. You gotta deal with it differently, hon. If we hadn't stormed McAllister's office, you would actually be Captain of 19 by now. So, we're down to two. Uh, and we're done search. Oh, weird. Not yet? I hate her final pick. And she hates mine? Okay, not eight in either case, but why can't it just be my pick? Because it's not just your baby? Uh, yeah. Exactly, and it's not just hers. I mean, she's carrying, and it's gonna be her egg. Now she wants to use donor sperm from a guy who looks just like her brother. I mean, this baby's gonna be 100% delicate, zero bishop. You wanna use your egg? No, and I don't particularly wanna be a pregnant person right now either, but I just wish they had both of us. Not just her and some right now. I get, I get that. Do you really think it'd be captain by now? I mean, yeah. If I had promoted to battalion chief like I was on track to, you were next in line. Well, technically, but should well, you jump her in line? <laughs> true. I'm shut up now. That's true. <laughs> but let me talk. Okay. Okay, I'm talking right now because that's what I said. She wants to be a part of it. She doesn't want it to be 100% Karina. Like, I mean, of course, at the end, she won't mind, but she wants to feel a part that, of her there, you know? So she wants to at least be able to pick the donor. So I hope they get together. They figure out who is going to be the donor. And hopefully they can agree on that. Because, of course, I understand Maya wanting to be a part of it and wanting to have a part of her in the pregnancy. So I get it. <laughs> but it's hilarious how, how she gets very angry and she starts like uh, and she's like come very fast on the on the bike and it's hilarious. Um but yeah, I really hope they talk about this and they choose a donor. Yeah, but I want Maya to be a part of it. Like she she needs to be okay with it. Yeah. Hope you find your sperm. Hope you find your sperm. I mean I wish Maya had a bit of sperm. I would love her to be my baby daddy. Obviously. <sighs> Thought you were gonna wait for me to get back. Okay, well, it's been four hours. You're gonna be mad at me because I didn't wait for you to take a pill? You know, you have seen me do it already That's today. That's not just so a pill. You... It's a very specific, you know, why don't you want me in your life? You keep finding ways to, you know, whittle me down and shut me out and, uh... I told you about, about Gibson and then you walked away. I didn't walk what? away. You pushed me. Oh, well, I guess it didn't take much. So wow. I don't know what... Wow. Uh... Okay. Oh, come on, guys. You know, you can you rewrite that story all you want. <laughs> But the fact is, you did everything you could to make sure you were alone. All I'm trying to do is be there for you through this. It. Despite my own feelings, because that's what you do when you love someone. What are and you, you won't even let me do that. What are your own feelings? Doesn't matter. No, it does, it does matter. It does matter because I would like to know. What are your own no, feelings? No, you wouldn't. Because if you did, you would have already asked. Okay. <sighs> I hate this because I think, obviously, she was allowed to have feelings about all this. But she did push him away after Dean died. You know, I think she wanted to be alone and she kind of pushed everyone away, even Travis. So I get that. I get that, that he feels like she pushed him away. I get it. I think they have a lot to talk about still. And I can't wait to see how this is going to progress because he obviously has a lot of more feelings about this whole situation. So I can't wait to see how that's going to go. So, yeah. Let's keep watching. Oh, Harry! Harry, wait, don't do that! Don't do that, Harry! What the hell? Harry, don't do that! He's having, like, a nervous breakdown or something, right? Because you can't turn the car on if you have a puddle of gasoline at your feet, okay? Open the door, Harry. Yeah, you're gonna explode. 
We need to call the engine before this man lights himself on fire. Well, if a bunch of cop cars and a fire truck show up, it can spook him into dropping that. Yeah, but if the engine comes, we can at least hose him down. I'm not putting the firefighter at risk. Go. Oh, shit. Okay. It's not going to be good if she calls. Like, it's just going to... Center drive, no lights, no sirens. I repeat, no lights, no sirens. Okay, yeah, because if not, he's going to be spooked. What are we studying today? Bylaws. She's still studying it, hey, just uh, in case. Bishop, you uh, read the bylaw manual forwards and backwards. What would be the exact process of a firefighter was suspected of drinking on the job? You should know fire, Zaddy. Wait, that was for drug abuse, not drinking. My bad. The firefighter would immediately be asked to submit an alcohol test. Depending on the results, there would be administrative leave and possible termination following an investigation. Now, that sounds really serious. What would the process okay. be if a lieutenant were found to have traded sexual favors for his position oh. i'm kidding bitch. It's just uh <laughs> hypothetical right so like, uh, uh, she's like what was okay. that no it's just an inside joke we got going on see we could pick a donor and that donor could end up being back it mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. hopefully not hopefully it's not gonna be anyone like him yeah, no.